Pokemon Trainer Alex He's almost as big as the big man himself. True. He's, he's that far is far a tall guy. Right. So right now we have Louis and Donny Zura. So this is one of those matchups that are like kind of okay for uh, for trainer. Like yeah, this is, I, I mean DD has gone on record saying trainer effectively wins. I don't agree, but yeah, I, I think I mean trainer does very well. But, but trainer but, does yeah. do well. Yeah, because like. A lot of the things that like Steve does to wall people out kinda doesn't work versus Ivysaur, which is really good. Like that. Look, the Tetris. Yeah. Gone. You spoke it into existence. Yeah. yeah. It, uh, so Razor Leaf goes through the, the minecart, which is oh, fucking that's really I did that's not really nice. Yeah, actually. I didn't know that actually. That's funny. Yeah. So, ooh, ooh, so does Vine with. Yeah. Yeah, catching the startup on that time. Yeah, I'm always I don't know. I just think of when I think of like Steve a lot of the times. I just can't help but think of, of all the things people aren't doing, partially because I watch a lot of Syrup, and like Syrup tries to do everything, and he's sick with it. Uh, but it's like, every time I think about that, it's like, I don't really think there's a lot of characters that can beat as Steve, that can comfortably say they're winning against Steve, that can do everything. And PT's one of those where Whoa. definitely even, but if that Steve's doing everything, I don't, I don't think I can call that winning for PT. That's a yeah. fair assessment to make. I think uh, when BT gets Steve off stage, uh, like the way uh, Trainer has like some pretty lingering like aerials, uh, like basically just Ivy's nair. Uh, if the Steves want to recover low, they're going to be reset into like a really awkward position, which can be really good. Um, unfortunately, like it's a little bit hard to. Oh, that's yeah, a little advice. I don't know why you would do that. Yeah. yeah. Like, <laughs> All right. Job. Good job, Charizard. Yeah. <laughs> Rogue clocked in. I, I would not. Uh, me, the big Squirtle advocate, would not advocate for Squirtle in this matchup. Yeah, Squirtle but. seems like the rough one, unless you're trying to play, like, really, really, like, you keep away once Squirtle. You, yeah, like, if you have a good lock on your opponent's, uh, like, habits and their movement, Squirtle is, like, a game two or game three pick, uh, yeah. like, for early damage, where you just completely just, like, really confuse your opponent. Like, they're not ready for it. Like, you've gotten all the data you needed from your other characters, and, like, you can rack up damage, like, super fast. But, like, you know, it does require, like, a certain confidence uh, to, to, like, make that happen. Um, and the opponent's left wondering, like, bro, this thing, this turtle's, like, one foot four. Why he got hands? Yeah, Squirtle's a jump scare uh, in this matchup. In the yeah. matchups where, like, you don't normally play Squirtle, oh, yeah. like, yeah. yeah and it's this matchup really seems built for the characters that get a lot of value off of playing at arm's reach, like Ivysaur yep. with her offstage game and general ability to, to stuff out Steve in a lot of ways, Charizard's ability yeah. to finish stocks. Forward air and Razor Leaf do really go hard against Vine Card and just like like the general like kind of boxing tools that Steve has uh, with like how active like Fair is and stuff like that, which is like really good. Uh, and then yeah, uh, Charizard, you do a line and see what happens. <laughs> Right. <laughs> Sometimes the game plan is vibe first, think second. Yeah. Oh wow, wow. My Did he bounce off the block? He went straight I off. Think so. Yeah, he might have not. Because Florida is sending. Might have been holding anyway, all the so. way in on that one. Yeah, that's tough. But all the same, game one going to Louis. Yeah. Rest in peace, King. We are. It is the Louis only now. <laughs> Rest in peace, King. He's dead. That's really funny. King is dead. It's Louis now. And he's never coming back. He's ne nope. <laughs> I think that's that. 
There was a Steve I was playing with earlier today. Those or in the casuals right before this bracket. It's like, you know, you're not bad. You're not bad, but you're like, I feel like he's not getting a lot of chances to start to run his game plan a little bit. Like we're seeing, we're seeing him as Steve try to do the bare bones basic stuff, where like I set up blocks and I like prepare for the future, but without that comfortability of mining. And, or the comfortability of like constantly hitting your opponent away, like that's like where like this, yeah, like this is where the Steve needs to get his instant value, and I'll, like I think that's something underrated about how Steve plays, where you want to get that instant value right at the start of the game, so you can be comfortable mining deep into stock one and start really feel Man, prepared. I really don't understand why you you Louis saw it too, right? Over seventy percent to get no hits in Squirtle, and then. Immediately get the like, what, bro? You could have, you could be at zero right now. You could actually, <laughs> you could actually be at zero. Imagine Ivysaur. No, but he at wants zero. the rage. He I, wants the rage. <laughs> Ivysaur has taken no hits. <laughs> that like, <laughs> feel that. It feels bad for Ivysaur. They're getting left with the taxes that <laughs> to oh, Squirtle oh, gave them. Honestly, <laughs> like brother, you have the character select screen. Just change to Ivysaur. <laughs> Ivysaur had to file as head of household. <laughs> <laughs> Squirtle's just causing a muck. <laughs> <laughs> Squirtle, why is our phone bill so high? Like, what did you do? <laughs> Squirtle is just zooming on TikTok. You see his little fucking little paws why is just, just swiping on. Oh. Why? Why am I too small? He why do I have a fifteen hundred Poké Dollar charge on Roblox? What's goes, going on? And Squirtle says skibbity, and you're like, God damn it! <laughs> oh, we no. lost him. Oh lord. Yeah, this uh, is this is good head. Back yeah. This is fun. Oh, all right, yeah, peace out, fucking nice. deleted. I saw the attempt at the back air. Yeah, ju just start the squirtle. Just start the Ivy Sword. Like, you feel great about playing down tilt Razor Leaf and forcing Steve to try and walk at you. Ew. And he jumped, but Steve has a terrible double jump, Ew. so you explode. <laughs> oh my god, that was disgusting. <laughs> he evaporated. We got a request for Station 21, but it looks like this match might be over, so we can yeah. we'll just stick around to the end. Luis is playing it pretty solid. Got to do the Pokemon Trainer Teams versus Steven. Ooh, it's so tough though to oh. think about. Oh, double forward air from this mi uh, double diamond dunk. Diamond tools, man. But did not hit the magma up smash backboard, unfortunately. I kind of appreciate oh, there the, the run up down tilt. It's like, Ivysaur has only two fast moves, being dash attack and down tilt. Those are frame four. Um, that's frame four? That was frame four. Yeah. Wow, that's fast. Yeah, but then you realize the tiny shoulder checked it with no movement, and you're like, oh, okay. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> but like, the, the run up down tilt, I can kind of see as like a, as like a, a little bit of a slower dash attack, I guess, right? Yeah. But yeah. it's like more disjointed, so. Luis needs to chill out, though. He's yeah, getting a little Rose bit killing himself. That, that should have been a back air for his life, but instead. Does Donnie know. not have the Phantom Reverse block setups? Okay, boom. You don't need. Oh, oh we don't know Just what the eye is. Just do it again? We don't know what the eye is. On to 21. Pokemon Trainer is on the way. 